Our junior sedans handle everything. Go, we're racing, and it is car number two that gets the better of the jump, and that's Billy McDonald. Leads Mitch Bayfield to the top corner for the first time. Heading down the back, straight away, slips straight out into the concrete, and that shows just how wet the racetrack will be for our junior drivers. Mitch Bayfield is the race leader, one lap down. Car number two, Billy McDonald, changing places with Cooper Reed as they go around the top corner, stay down low on the racetrack is where everybody now knows. William Pagel would be the next one just to the better of Aidan Rigby. Have a look who's there then. Jackson Cunney tucked in there in front of Cooper Flynn as they go through the hairpin corner. Sam James goes by as our lead cars head down the back chute one more time. And that is Mitchell Bayfield into the hairpin corner to the better. Oh, Billy McDonald, next one through. AJ McDonald and chasing hard. Aidan Rigby back to William Pagel would be the next one. And then Jackson Cunney, our race leader coming up to put a lap on Emily Steffens. will go to the outside as they head up the zinc straight away. Race leader, Mitchell Bayfield. One in trouble with car two, Billy McDonald but gets it back online, but he's dropped backwards a few places. Getting on to the infield is car number 44 of Sam James. Again, it's the 17 car. Cooper Reed giving, oh, sorry, the uh, AJ McDonald giving the concrete a bit of a nudge as again they head up the straightaway. Race leader is down in the back straightaway. That will be Mitch Bayfield, Bayfield leading into the hairpin corner and around the hairpin and heads up the zinc straight away, going to the outside of Cohen Herwig. Chloe Libetta would be the next one and he's being run down ever so quickly by Aidan Rigby. So Rigby's on a mission as they head down the back straight away. One going very high was uh, Cooper Flynn. Back then behind William Pagel now. So uh, Cooper Flynn tucked in there. We've got a bit of a problem with one car getting off the racetrack. And that Jackson Cunney is back in action. We'll go back to our race leader through the hairpin corner. And up the main straightaway, it's still Mitchell Bayfield. Aidan Rigby in hot pursuit. We'll go back then, a real battle for position number three is between William Pagel, who moves aside and allows Cooper Flynn to go through. The next one is Cooper Reed. Jackson Cunney still out there, and we're back with our race leader as he heads up the zinc straight away under the tower, and it is Mitchell Bayfield. Still leads the way with Aidan Rigby closing in at every turn of the wheel as they head down the back chute. So the action right at the front of the field. Mitchell Bayfield versus Aidan Rigby. Rigby right on his hammer as they go under the tower one more time. And down towards Pagel's corner. Mitchell Bayfield. Aidan Rigby up the inside. Bayfield shuts the door. You're not going through there. So Rigby will have to think of something a little better than an inside pass around Pagels. Up the zinc straight away one more time. Mitchell Bayfield, Aidan Rigby again, right on his hammer as they go into Pagels this time. And uh, Mitchell Bayfield overdrives it a little bit and Aidan Rigby says thank you. Drives straight into position number one as he goes careering now up the zinc straight away. Under the tower, Mitchell Bayfield is still in position number three. And then we go back. Cooper Flynn will be in three. Back then to William Pagel. Then we've got a whole gaggle of cars as uh, Cooper Reed it is. Gets through. Chloe Labita would be the next one as uh, we've, our race leader is in trouble and has retired to the pit area. That will leave Mitchell Bayfield. 
out there amongst the lead cars down the main straight or down the back straight away he goes just getting under Chloe Labetta back in position number two probably will go all the way back to Cooper Flynn under the tower with just a few laps remaining as they take the white flag for Mitchell Bayfield around Pagel's corner for the last time Mitchell Bayfield is the race leader got a good lead back then to Cooper Flynn Long way back behind him, probably to uh, William Pagel. Check it, flag time. Mitchell Bayfield to the better of Cooper Flynn across the line. We'll wait for William Pagel. We'll complete the journey in position number three. Cooper Reed gets across the line as well. Well, some trying track conditions for our juniors. Put your hands together for them, folks. Great effort. Great effort and a great win. Mitchell Bayfield. Feature race win. Will get to do his lap of honour. Yeah, that's right, folks. Put your hands together for him as he goes around. Great drive by the young fellow. Survived the night, won the feature race and gets to drive it back on the trailer to take it home. We'll try and have a word too, if we could, with uh, young Mitchell. A good name in the Speedway world, the Bayfields.